Hello and welcome to Accolade. In this video session, we demonstrate the power of Accolade through the use of the reverse engineering function of an existing MongoDB instance. To do so, I've chosen to use the Yelp Challenge dataset, about 2.2 million reviews, uh, half a million users, 77,000 businesses. I imported the Yelp database into a local MongoDB running on my laptop using Mongo import. And um, if we go to a Mongo shell to use uh, and use Yelp, um, we can then do a DB print uh, collection stats and uh, verify we've got here half a million uh, users. If we go up, uh, almost 600,000 tips, uh, 2.225,000 uh, 2, uh, reviews, etc., etc. Now let's go to Hackolade and start with a new empty model. Go to Tools, Reverse Engineering, MongoDB Collections. And in this dialog, I'm able to add new collection uh, connection settings to a database instance, including authentication and SSH access uh, to a cloud instance, for example. Or here, I'm simply going to select the local connection to a port, uh, default port 27017, uh, and connect. It fetches all of the databases on my local instance here, and I select um, all of the collections of the Yelp database. When I submit, the system will go through a, a series of steps, including for each collection, a statistical sampling, followed by a probabilistic inference of the fields of each document sampled. Finally, it transforms all of this into a Hackolade schema. The import just takes a few seconds. I cannot start to enrich the imported schema with documentation and comments. I can give here a name to the model, um, the Yelp Challenge dataset, for example. Uh, enter a description. I can do a multiple select by pressing the control key and clicking the mouse. And then I can do an align middle. And then maybe I will do a multiple select here and a line center, and then move this down a little bit and refit. Notice also that some fields belong to uh, more than one collection. So for example, here we find a user ID which probably refers to the user's collection. And here we see a business ID that probably um, refers to the business's uh, collection. So let's create some uh, documentation of these implicit relationships. So let's go to the tips collection. And for the business underscore ID field, let's document a foreign key relationship to the underscore ID field of uh, the businesses collection. Now, if we go back to the entity relationship diagram, we can also set the cardinality of uh, each side of the uh, of the relationship line. And so here, uh, one business can be referenced uh, into zero to many uh, tips in the, in the tips collection. Similarly, the user ID uh, field in the uh, tips collection can be referenced to the user's collection and to the user ID, under, the underscore ID field of the user's collection. And so now we have this relationship here. We now have a visual representation of the Yelp data set. This makes it a lot easier to analyze the data, understand how to query it, and basically visualize it. 
And this is for a database of just a half dozen collections. Imagine what Accolade can do to help you manage and grow your operations and the development with more complex databases and big data. We conclude here this video session. Please consult accolade.com for additional information. Thank you for your attention.